Most people in America are familiar with the concept of a bad behaving employee. A bad behaving employee usually spouts his mouth off and does destructive things on behalf of a company. America is a business, and in this case, we have made a transition in our government with removing a poor performing employee and replacing them with a new opportunity for America. The new opportunity for America is to embrace the new president of our business, America. And by embracing the new president of the business of America, we are also including Vice President Harris. President Biden and Vice President Harris are coming in to lead and serve America. They're taking up the slack where things were locked off and where things were missing and bringing in new ideas and new information. Every day they're playing a little bit of catch up because America has been a business a long time. And America has been creating relationships across the world, around the globe, with important leaders who are allies and are enemies for a long time. At the same time, they have a lot of inside America work to do, which we might call inner office politics, of dealing with the senators and representatives who serve below them. So therefore, in America, we've got some leaders with a lot of pressure on them, and I think as a general population, as an individual of American citizenship, we need to give them a little bit of a break. In other words, we need to be supportive of the new president and the new vice president in a way that allows them to do their job on behalf of you and me.